have Douglas sporting my very old sunglasses that I've never worn. They've lived in his car for the past four or five years and they're his go-to sunglasses when he forgets his. <laughs> Thanks for coming down again, guys. Yeah, no, thanks. Next time, I'll come up. Yeah. All right, look yeah. after yourself. Yeah. And you. And we're back home. As you can understand, um, didn't film much this afternoon. Did think I would film a little bit more today, but because the weather was bad, we didn't end up going down to the beach or anything like that. We went to a pub and had Daddy. a Sunday roast, which was nice. Daddy. Daddy. Can you just hear Delilah going, Daddy, Daddy? To be honest, I'm always in the mood for roast. I love a good roast. A bit gravy, roast tatties. I had a vegetarian nut roast. Delilah had the same, but off the kids' menu, so a smaller version. She kind of just ate the giant Yorkshire pudding and, and left it at that, really. She didn't Daddy. really want any of the other stuff. <laughs> currently got some dinner on for her right now because she's very hungry and yeah we went back to my dad's and had a coffee with him and a catch-up and then before we knew it we had to leave hi gorgeous take your shoes off uh, Lola. yeah other one Ooh. shoes yeah Lola. <laughs> there we go it's been a nice sunday but i went to my spin class as usual but I don't need to start every Sunday with oh I'm going off to spin and showing you spin you guys get that I go to spin on a Sunday but it was a good spin class I definitely can feel myself improving slash I think it helped that I had a big bowl of pasta last night because I didn't feel as sick and shaky during and after not that I actually really do that often now but I don't know I definitely think having big bowl of pasta last night um kind of helped me out during spin class this morning <laughs> Uh, thank you. I'm having one of my Ow. moments today where at the end of, towards the end of the day, sort of mid-afternoon, end of the day, I get headache, sore throat. I feel kind of like hot and a bit high gorgeous and a bit just like not well, like I'm going to come down with something tomorrow. Whoa. Oh, oh dear. You're very gorgeous. That was a mighty old fool. Ooh. What are you doing? Ow. Ow. Did that hurt? <laughs> Where's Daddy? Can we just take a moment to appreciate how cute Delilah's outfit is? I love it. You gonna have a nice bath with Daddy? Duck. It is a duck. Yeah. Where's, where's Delilah? What are you doing? <laughs> 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 oh, no, 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 no,
nom 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 in the place I spend a lot of time because I need to get on and do some editing. Do you know what Doug and I are going to do for dinner? Because we had quite a big mid-afternoon lunch. So I'll probably just have snacky things. I think I've got some soup in the fridge or something. So I'll probably have that. Yeah, anyway, right. Let's get on with some editing. It's Monday morning, Delilah's at the childminders. Not done anything more than just get out of bed and fling whatever clothes we're in arms reach on. Which can only mean one thing. It is a it is a work day and the kind of work day where I'm just pinned to my computer, although saying that I do need to go into town. But apart from that, I kind of plan on spending the next few days just looking like this and doing a lot of editing. I've got loads of footage to import from this camera and a lot of editing to do. I've already done a couple of hours of editing and I just felt like making myself a chamomile tea and a little bowl of fruit. As much as I love spending time with Delilah, obviously because she's my daughter. <laughs> it is nice that the holidays are over because it means I get proper time to do stuff. I feel like this right to here is why it was good for me doing every other day vlogs because you didn't get so much of this which is not very entertaining. I've just said it in the vlog where I've inserted footage from a personal training session that I had over a month ago now. It's really weird watching it back because it looks like you're putting no effort in, it looks like it's not hard at all, but when you're doing it, it really is. The faces I pull as well, I, I just think to myself, why am I putting this on the internet? I'm heading out quickly. I've got a couple of important things to go do. It's gonna be so much easier when we can reveal everything that's been going on this month, but until then, I'm still keeping quiet. But as I'm going into town, I'm gonna to meet my grandma for a quick coffee. And then before I head home, I need to get things like bread for um, our breakfast and Delilah's lunches. The weather's gonna to start to really warm up this week. So I'm making the most of wearing my favorite jumper because I know that very soon this will have to go away. I probably won't be getting it out until the um, until end of autumn. Popped on this jumper with my ASOS mum jeans and then I've got my Topshop. Uh, what would you even, what would you call these shoes? They're sort of like sandals sort of cut out shoes, sandals. I mean, a cut out shoe is a sandal, isn't it? I'm loving these shoes at the moment. Anyway, let's go. My pom-poms have just fallen off my key ring. I don't think it'll be too hard to sew them back on, but I don't have time to do that right now, so I'm gonna have to leave that there. Oh, <laughs> a lot of you asked me where this is from, and this is from an Etsy shop that I found. I will uh, see if I can find it and link it in the description. <laughs> Grab some lunch whilst uh, I was in prep because I just I can't. I have to be honest, I can't be bothered to um, make any when I get home. Picked up a couple of things because I couldn't make my mind up. So I've got little apple and halloumi wrap and the vegetable tagine. Thank you. Just had to buy these in boots because these shoes keep slipping. Oh my gosh! Amazing. That has completely done the trick. So if you've got shoes or sandals that are slipping, I definitely recommend those funny little, I didn't even know those were a thing until I looked in the uh, blister plaster section. Back home, and now time to crack on with some more work before I need to go get Delilah. I'm gonna finish off my falafel and halloumi wrap that I didn't finish because I don't know about you guys but I find it so awkward eating stuff like this in public and mainly I think it's because of my silly teeth because on one side they don't they don't um they don't meet normal people <laughs> can bite down with their front teeth and it 
bites a chunk of their sandwich off. Whereas if I bite down on something, because my teeth aren't breaking the food, everything just comes out in one go. And I just get like big chunks of pepper and lettuce and all sorts coming out and I just find it terribly awkward <laughs> eating in public. It was nice to get out for a little bit and I had a nice chat with my grandma. We both got coffees and a bit of lunch. Got the stuff I needed to get done, picked up some stir fry bits for dinner. Change of shoes because there's no way I can run in those other ones. And time to get Delilah from the childminders. Having our usual uh, slow stroll home, aren't we? And uh, it's, it feels weird wearing my um, wearing my ballet pumps because I I haven't worn these for so long. Definitely feels like spring now. And it's lovely weather. Look, sun, proper sun. And it doesn't feel like winter sun. It feels like proper spring sun. It's lovely. <laughs> hear the birds singing as well. Stick. <laughs> God, you're so fast. <laughs> bee, have you found a bee? Oh, thank you. I am feeling like a right old scruff bag today. Gonna make sure I wash and plait my hair tonight so it gives it gives it some life back, but I cannot wait to get it trimmed next Tuesday. As you can see, Delilah and I are playing with her stickers. She is obsessed with stickers. Stickers were the last thing I really thought about ever getting her. Thank you. <laughs> I've always tried to give her colouring books or not that I expect her to really colour properly but I know she can at least just like scribble on the pages but she doesn't really like colouring that much. She prefers putting the pens in and out of the pen pot than she does actually draw in. It's never really kept her that occupied and then the other day I thought oh let's get her a sticker book. I think maybe she'll like stickers and she is now obsessed as you can tell. Um, I have to like double check myself when I leave the house sometimes just in case I've got a sticker on me. Dog didn't quite make it home in time for bath time, which meant I did bath time today. I had the bubble machine, we were doing lots of bubbles like we do most bath time. And then uh, she cleaned her teeth, wrapped her up in the towel, and then we have to look in the mirror and clean teeth. My battery's on now, and I don't know where my other one is. I used to have three, three batteries for this camera. Good morning guys. Yes, I'm looking even more of a scruff bag than uh, than yesterday. All of a sudden it feels like spring summer. I'm wearing a vest and jeans. That's it. This isn't the most flattering vest. Like I would never wear this out in public. This is such an old vest. Like look, it's like the worst shape. And then I've got like <laughs> a funny black bra underneath it. But wearing my ASOS mum jeans and this white top makes me feel like my mum in the 90s because I remember my mum wearing outfits like this a lot in the late 90s. All I need now is some um, oval black glasses. I remember my mum had like some coloured Ozzy Osbourne style or I guess you could say John Lennon style glasses and then also like some cool sleek oval ones. I just feel like I need those with my backpack and it will be a flashback to my mum's 20s. Anyway I'm gonna get on with work. I'm so happy spring's here. Spring and autumn are my favourite seasons just because you can feel the change of season in the air and the temperature is always perfect for me. It's not too hot, it's not too cold. I love spring and I love autumn. What are your favourite um seasons let me know i feel like surely winter is no one's favorite season i can winter's my least favorite season i have spring and autumn as my favorites i can't 
compare them because they're just so different and then it would be summer second and then third would be winter but i just I don't like winter at all. I really like going every day. I think maybe this is like my fifth. When I've got too much work to do and not enough brain space to think about what to have for lunch, it's usually uh, cheesy baked beans on toast for me. Today's video is all done and it's just exported. After I had my lunch, I spent about an hour doing emails and some other admin bits, invoices, and catching up on some vlogs. I like to um, put vlogs on in the background, kind of like you would have the radio on. I've got about half an hour until I need to get Delilah. As you can see, I have not washed my hair. I'm gonna just have, I'm just gonna have to do it later. But what I am gonna do now is pop some washing on, load the dishwasher, tidy the kitchen a little bit. I have been loving this acoustic covers playlist on Spotify today. Pop that on the kitchen Google Home. home with this little one and um, we've been home a while now just been having a snack and cuddles this spot is really good for lighting when I'm vlogging but I hate vlogging in this spot because I really don't like that fireplace uh, I've just realized I need to clean Delilah's sticky mitts off of it <laughs> is that funny oh. but anyway yeah Delilah's playing with her play-doh which is another thing she is obsessed with at the moment that and stickers are her uh, are her thing and we've just got Teletubbies on in the background. Whilst her dinner cooks I'm going to do some more emails although I'm sure she won't let me do much because as soon as I get my laptop out she usually comes over and wants to tap all the keys but I'm gonna try. It smells funny doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Are you dancing? <laughs> <laughs> Good dancing. <laughs> rabbit. It's a rabbit. You see rabbits? Oh, rabbits. <gasps> rabbit. Yes. Uh -oh. <laughs> even give me a chance. I haven't even typed in my password to log on to my account, let alone do anything. Thank you. of my jeans and the bathroom floor. I mean, we're only two minutes into bath time and we've already got a puddle on the floor. My jeans are wet. <laughs> very painful breakouts on my forehead today. There's no rhyme or reason behind um, my breakouts. I can remember when I saw the dermatologist, she was like, don't wear makeup as much, change the foundation you use. Yet, um, the last two years, I've worn makeup the least amount of days during the weeks 
than I ever have and I used to wear makeup every day when I was younger and I'd have a clear skin yet the last year or two my skin's been the worst it's ever been and I wear makeup the least it makes no sense and this week I've I mean as you guys have seen I've really not worn much makeup the last couple of weeks and I'm getting really painful breakouts it, I genuinely think it's hormonal but yeah anyway I'm just cutting up some veg for dinner we had um half a courgette in our fridge to use up so I've just chopped that up and I'm going to saute some spinach and do some petit pois for dinner tonight again it was a bit of a just see whatever we had and just fling it in the oven a little bit like lunch I've got some sweet potato roast in um, to kind of semi mash up and make kind of like a a chunky sweet potato mash. I've got two of my Linda McCartney veggie sausages there and then Doug bought some meat sausage sausages to have and um, he'll have a few tonight and then a few for his lunch tomorrow. I know, super exciting stuff, isn't it guys? And because we're having mash and sausages, we've gotta have some gravy and you can't beat Bisto gravy. You guys can't really see what I'm doing there, can you? I am really looking forward to this. I kind of wish I'd done a little bit more sweet potato now because I thought I did loads, mashed it, and now it looks like a really tiny portion, but actually it was a huge, huge potato. And then we've got the peas, spinach, courgette with a bit of garlic, salt and pepper. And it's Tuesday, which means catching up on Made in Chelsea. I'm going to end today's video here and wrap up this video. This will likely be three days in um, in one video. I think some people are getting confused because they're counting the videos, but actually um, I've popped it in the title, I've popped it in the thumbnail and I put it on the videos as well, the different date, because some videos are two vlogs, some are just one and some are a few. But I will see you guys in the next video. We are halfway through, uh, I think. Uh, no, are we over halfway through? I, I couldn't even tell you what date it is, to be honest. I'll see you tomorrow. It will be another technically technical work day for me, but I'll, I'll keep it short and sweet, and then we'll move on to Thursday, um, which will be lovely. The weather's going to get really nice. Plan to go for a picnic, and uh, yeah, and then we'll see, see, what else, see what else happens. So until then, um, I hope you're all well, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.